ripple off the coast of Naples. Fishermen noticed it first, bubbles breaking through the calm blue surface. Then came a low rumble that seemed to echo from below the sea. What looked peaceful on the outside was hiding something enormous. Scientists now believe that the sea near Naples is literally starting to boil, not from heat alone, but from gases rising from deep underground. Something powerful is waking up beneath southern Italy, and the entire region is being closely watched. This isn't just any random part of the Mediterranean. This is Campi Flagre, the burning fields, one of the most dangerous supervolcano systems on Earth. It sits right next to the crowded city of Naples, home to more than three million people. The ground that breathes. For years, the ground in this area has been rising and falling like it's breathing. Scientists call this bradycism, slow uplift and sinking caused by magma or gases shifting below. In the town of Pozzuoli, the land has lifted by more than four meters since the 1950s. Streets have cracked, ancient Roman buildings have tilted, and parts of the coast that were once underwater now sit above the sea. But what's happening now feels different. Recent satellite data shows that the seafloor near Naples is rising again faster than before. New vents have opened, releasing bubbles of carbon dioxide and sulfur. The water is shimmering with heat and gas, giving the surface that boiling look that locals are terrified by. Giant Chamber Below Deep beneath the Campi Flagre region lies a massive magma chamber, wide enough to stretch under the Bay of Naples itself. Scientists once thought this chamber was mostly solidified, but new measurements tell a different story. Using advanced radar and GPS instruments, researchers have discovered that molten magma is slowly pushing upward, melting rock as it rises. The magma hasn't reached the surface yet, but pressure is building. That pressure has caused thousands of small earthquakes, sometimes dozens in a single day. In the past, these swarms would stop after a few weeks. This time they're continuing. Why Scientists Are Alarmed One volcanologist described the current situation as a ticking clock, not because an eruption is guaranteed, but because all the warning signs that usually happen before an eruption are appearing at the same time. 1. Ground uplift. The land is rising at record speed. 2. Gas emissions. High levels of CO2, helium, and sulfur dioxide are escaping. 3. Seismic swarms. Quakes are growing shallower, closer to the surface. Each of these on its own might not mean disaster, but together they paint a worrying picture. Some experts say the system is reaching a critical point where the rock above the magma chamber could fracture, allowing gas and molten material to burst through. Others warned that even without a full eruption, the release of underground pressure could cause massive steam explosions under the sea, sending boiling water and ash into the sky. The Hidden Boiling Sea the area scientists are most focused on now lies between Pozzuoli and the Bay of Naples, a section of the seafloor that has become unstable. Drones and thermal cameras showed that the temperature of the water there has increased by several degrees, and plumes of gas are continuously rising. The water looks like it's simmering, hundreds of small vents releasing energy from below. The last time this happened was before a major explosion in 1538, when a brand new volcano, Monte Nuovo, suddenly rose from the ground in just a few days. That eruption was small compared to what Campi Flagre could be capable of, but it completely reshaped the coastline. Towns disappeared, new hills formed, and the bay itself changed shape. Could it happen again? Scientists don't know exactly when or how the next eruption might happen, but they agree on one thing. The system is far from quiet. What worries them most is that Campi Flagre has become weaker over time. With every episode of uplift, the rock above the magma chamber cracks a little more. That means it could take less pressure than before to break through. If magma reaches the surface under the sea, it could instantly turn seawater into steam, creating violent explosions, a hydrothermal blast powerful enough to devastate the surrounding coast.
the Italian Civil Protection Department has already raised the alert level for the region and increased monitoring stations. Evacuation routes are being reviewed and siren systems are being tested. Authorities insist this is precautionary, but locals aren't reassured. Many still remember the 1980s crisis when tens of thousands were evacuated after similar warning signs. A chain reaction beneath Italy. Campi Flegre isn't isolated. It's connected to a much larger volcanic network that includes Mount Vesuvius, the same volcano that buried Pompeii in AD 79. Some scientists believe deep magma channels may link the two systems. If pressure builds too quickly in one, it could affect the other. That's why the current unrest in Campi Flagre is being watched worldwide. The idea of a chain reaction, where one volcano's movement triggers another, is terrifying, but not impossible. The Boiling Sea and What Lies Ahead The Boiling Sea off Naples is more than just a strange sight. It's a visible sign that something big is happening underground. Gases don't escape for no reason. They rise when heat and magma move closer to the surface. For now, scientists are relying on seismographs, GPS, and satellite imagery to track every small change. But nature doesn't always give a clear warning. In a region so densely populated, even a small eruption could have enormous consequences. Imagine a sudden blast under the sea, waves racing toward the coast, ash falling over Naples, the sky turning red from reflected light. This isn't science fiction. This has happened before. What we can learn. The situation around Naples reminds us how alive our planet is. The same forces that built Italy's beautiful coastline are also capable of destroying it. Campi Flagre is one of the few places on Earth where scientists can literally watch a supervolcano breathing, stretching, cracking, and changing shape in real time. Every bubble that breaks the surface of that sea is a message from below. Something is moving, and the world is watching. Whether this ends quietly or violently, one thing is certain. The ground beneath Naples will never truly rest. This is Geology Watch. And this is the story of the boiling sea of Naples, where the earth itself is warning us, louder every day.